what's up, what's up, what's up, guys? I'm down here in New Braunfels, Texas. Welcome to the Rock and Rides River Show. I can never get the name right, but bear with me. I'm gonna do a lot, a lot of walking around, and I want you guys to see some of the cool rides that I'm actually witnessing right now at this moment. Hit that like and subscribe button, hit the bell icon, and enjoy. All right, just like I said, Rock and River Ride Show. This is the bus. They have a bus to block off the buses. And the buses, all the buses, to, as a border. What I'm looking at right now, I'm not even gonna try to name the vehicles because there's so many of them and there's so many custom rides around here. We have 100, I believe that's a Chevy. And you guys can go ahead and make your suggestions of what, of what it is. They're all sitting on airbags. Zoom out, take a look at that baby. A nice custom Chevy pickup. And the owners of this truck here, called the Grandpappy's Dream, they were really emphasizing the back because they really love this, this, um, this theme to the truck. The Grandpappy's Dream. They're showing you the interior. There's so many nice rides here that it's gonna be a nice coverage to everything that I'm filming right now. And I want you guys to enjoy this and take it all in because seeing this all in person is very surreal to, to see. Okay, we got the Elf Beetle. For a bit. Headlights on this thing, 1938. 1938. Let's look at the interior on this. Okay, and then we have a Dodge, classic Dodge with the patina. seater was a seven seater skeleton hand and then you have the old school AC looks like a nice little canister there so you got about a good seven seats in there one two three four five six seven it's actually an eight seater This is a beauty. Look at this beauty. I'm gonna do a nice 360 walk around on this one. And then looks like he's got his cousin beside him, but I'm not gonna get to that one yet. There's a lot of square inches, 42 inches on this car.
It's got the French yellows at the bottom. All of the yellow headlights you see in France. But of course, this is all American. All American sheet metal, all American muscle. He's even got the old dealer, the original dealer um, symbol right here. Kinsels out of Hobart, Texas. That's very unique because you don't see that too often with metal badges on there.
Chevy Camaro. Pickup truck is about to become YouTube famous on my channel. I'm popping it in there. He's about to and a half right That's it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's the owner right here, Mr. Brad Wixon. He's got the 10 inch wheels on it, pimping it out. Look at the interior. Check it out. The interior. I don't know if I can get the interior in here. There we go. There we go. Yep, the 10 inch wheels are the most comfortable for these cars because you got a lot of cushion versus my 13 inch wheels. This Camaro is a beast. He said there's about four or five horsepower. Look at the spectators, they are going nuts out here. All right, now we got the Mustang. identity like several times they didn't know whether it wanted to be a sports car they didn't know whether it wanted to be a country sedan they didn't know if it wanted to be a rooster the Mustang kept this composure
American muscle here. Just, just pull American bulk, American size. I wrote the
that out. No airbags. Prepare to die. Craziness. It's so unique, y'all, to look at. And it's clean, super clean. And I've never seen an air filter like this before. The top's normally all metal, but this one is actually filtered all the way around and on top. So you get some serious power out of this thing. And not only that, he's got Rustle mounted the headlights on it. Really nice. This is interesting.
check this out. School bus. This is probably one of the coolest looking school buses I've ever seen. Bondo High. I like it. Let's look inside.
<laughs> Got to get it all in. <laughs> oh my God, this is yours. Oh, this is so nice. Beautiful. What's nice about it? I love the paint job. I love the custom tail lights to it. Okay. You know, I, I just I like the sculpting to it. I mean, it's and 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 the way the suspension is. I love the stance. That's what I was looking at too. The uh, suspension stance on it, and the, the and the uh, exhaust on it. And and then uh, and then everything's smoothing out. Yeah, it's it's it's, it's a really nice job on this. Uh -huh. My first show, and I had no clue what I was doing. Really? Yeah. So Ooh. my first, my buddy John over here was helping me out in my, my brother's car, and he passed away six years ago. His labor of love. Mm. Oh wow. Okay, so it's, he's looking down at us now, saying we made it. And it's finally it's, it's finally like finished. Yeah, that is so beautiful. Thanks for saying so. Yeah, I, I mean, no it's so unique, yeah. I don't know what you guys are looking at. Yep, that's, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm going to put this on my YouTube channel. Okay, where are you? Uh, Gene C. Oh, Gene C? Yes. Okay. Yeah, so, and, um, and, um, I think it's Gene C. Yeah, 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 Gene C. Even the interior is amazing to look at. This is the first show this car has ever came to. And the story behind this, the original owner passed away and then his mother actually came through and finished up the car for him. Total labor of love, right there. Completely redone, frame off suspension, frame off restoration. car show of course here's the Rockin River this is the river in New Braunfels and of course the landscape back here is so synonymous because you can come literally come out here on a tube in the summertime and just float down the river and you can read a book you know it's just nice and leisurely but back to the car show I'm showing you off everything Oh, wow, look at this. Look how low 
other sense. Look at the regular ride height of this truck compared to this.
Yeah, yeah. 